Hey there friends, working on the low bench, I needed a better way to hold scrap wood like this piece of paduke so I could turn it into a piece like this, which is a spreader made from hand tools. So let me show you what I came up with. From this angle, I'm, I'm sitting in front of the bench and this allows me to do my sawing or chiseling uh, and just get a good view gets the work up high which is one of the downsides of the low bench is just the, the work is too low to do some of this more uh, detailed fine work. I can do chiseling from uh, the, the face or from the end works out very well but you're gonna see here in just a second as I open the clamp up the hand clamp itself doesn't hold slick wood extremely well as I'm putting pressure on it so I've added a couple of pieces of leather just glued them on with with wood glue uh, clamped them down nice and tight to get the pressure uh, and now it, it holds the work very snug as I, I I'm gonna rotate now and I'm gonna sit on the bench and I'm gonna start using the tools uh, you know either pulling them or pushing them and this allows me from this orientation to sight down the work and get a little bit better balance from the two sides. Uh, you can really see that from this end, uh, but we, I'm able to pull with, with the spoke shave with a pull cut, or I can take advantage of the spoke shave that very easily goes in the other orientation and do a push cut as well. Hey, there you have it, friends. Something as simple as a hand screw clamp added to an end vise really makes the low bench a lot more functional, uh, especially for this small, delicate work. Took me a, a year to figure this out. I've had this low bench for over a year and, and struggled with uh, some of the, the finer pieces, but uh, you know, a couple of these accessories added to the bench has, has made a huge difference. So. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, any ideas, any suggestions on other work holding ideas? Uh, if you have a suggestion and uh, it works out, I'd love to make a video about that. Always looking for ideas. Um, already uh, on several of the videos, uh, I've gotten some suggestions or feedback and, and been able to incorporate that into my workflow, uh, which is why I do this, because uh, I know there's people out there with a lot more experience than me and uh, can help me learn. Hopefully you can learn something too. Till next time, take care, God bless.